Hey, what's up, guys? Gaming Rage here, here to bring you some more Dying Light. Uh, I did want to be close to the cave when I started this video because I did drive her and I, I drive to the safe also over here. Oh. For some reason, I've, I've logged in it to you. What's that? Oh, bolts tissue. Right. First off, let me just say that, as you can see, I couldn't cancel quests, but uh, that radio boy, I think his, its name was, uh, I managed to do that. The big beefy fucker that was in there. Um, the only problem is I did that off camera, which I now regret, because now I have no proof to you guys that I did it. But basically, um, it's Molotovs, landmines, burning throwing stars. Lena. What I can see. Oh, hang on. Why haven't you contacted us? Lena, listen good while this damn thing works. I know what's going on. They have something a hundred times better than Anta's in. And the good news, they'll share it with me. The bad news, I need to find it. Now, I know the clock's ticking, but I can't let go of this yet. It's the best chance for all of us. I understand, Kyle, but please. More reason for me to get this done. Okay, as you can see, it's all in her hand. Anybody now I ran out of fancy, so I've got to hurry up and do this. How do I get past? Uh, as I was saying, with that, not to tell anything that caused an explosion and burning damage was the best way to beat that guy. Fuck off. But the only thing is, it was it was weird. I I could use a grenade and it'd take his health down a little bit. But then the throwing stars I'd use after that. Okay, now he's pissing me off. It seems like uh, the first hit you do will take it down a little bit. But each hit after that, like the damage will be greater than the last kind of thing. I'm not too sure if that's how it works or if it's just if that's just how it looked. But basically, like once I got, okay, I need fuel. Do we have enough? No. Um, if you're gonna do it, guys, once his fuel, once his health goes down, uh, after that, just keep fucking, just keep doing it at him, because you'd think a grenade would do more damage than a burning throwing star for example but I'd launch a grenade it'll take itself down a bit and then the next few throwing stars I'd, I'd launch at him will take itself down a hell of a lot more I think I did it I think I did it twice like I think it was two grenades or a grenade of the landmine I think it was a grenade of the landmine and then three or four burning throwing stars whilst he was stumbling and I'm pretty sure I got his health down like near enough halfway. So I could do the, uh, those other quests, but them ones. But they're basically going to be the exact same. And I don't either want to. No, great. Infected. Isn't this one of the Vault of Hives? I'm sure it's one of the Vault of Hives. Hang on a sec. Driver. Reinforced ramming bar, fuel efficiency. Uh, I'm gonna do the ramming bar again because the other part didn't really do much to help. Right. You guys are ones that have a Tell me a kick in the head just killed you. Right, one sec. Sort of inventory. Got anything else in that? I've not, have I? No. Right, let's go. Where's my fucking... No, I don't want that. Oh! 
Oh no, that's uh, that's that stuff in it. Yeah. Gotta remember that landmines are now. This doesn't look like a volatile cave. I'm sure this was a volatile cave before. I'll have rewatch a video. I'm probably chatting shit. Is that the old point of this? So you don't get it. Fucking working. There you go. Oh, yeah, okay, I'm up here, I don't know. It's what's back here. Anything back here, or is just just a scenery? I'm assuming it's something to do with this because this looks important. Doesn't seem to be. So what's over here? It just said search a cave, it didn't it is not saying what for. I think he was saying it was like a herb or something. Not a herb. Oh, there we are. There we are. Damaged. All right, then where are they? Can not get on that? I'd say I've got a user. It's not giving me any hints, it's just saying investigate it, but. I don't really think there's anything else to investigate. If I'm missing something very... Oh, hang on. Right, okay. Holy fuck, rises, man. Fucking will be one. Not the grenades. <laughs> Anyone else in here? one of them. Is there one over here? Can't check him now.
Is there something obvious that I'm missing again? So, okay guys, I'll see you in a second, just let me try and figure this out. Hey guys, I apologise about this. Me being bland as a bat, there was two people here. Listen, be on the lookout for orange uniforms, or, or a symbol, three horizontal stripes. Excuse me? The bandits in here, these are Rises thugs. They're worse than the undead. What happened in Haran, that's mostly their fault. Okay, oh, is that it? It's in your head and the children of a son. I don't have to do any quests, do I? <laughs> Fuck off, it just vaulted over you. out if necessary, right? Yes, please. The mother would very much like this man to finish what he started. Okay, who is it? His name is Attila. He's an ethnographer, working in the mother's mansion. In that big residence at the top of the cliff. Okay. Let's go. We'll go all the way back up that cave from the Sonda. That's what I was doing. I bloody use my med kit. I always got it wrong side. Says the story is up 90%, so I don't know how this is gonna go. Could be two missions, it could be five. And the videos are still gonna be roughly the same length. I'm wondering why this is slow. There we are. 
lot better. Shit. Also, just water. But yeah, the video is going to be like roughly the same length as it always have been. Um, I just I don't know how it's going to work. Bolter! Shit! No! Did I get it? I think I got it. Don't know why the bolters are out during the table. Original parts of Iron Light, but he only appeared at night. Most of green blisters, he's one of those. Kind of like a new breed of bolts and kind of thing. I didn't look at how long that first part was, I think it was like. I think it was roughly on a 10 minute map. So. This next part should be about 15 to 20 minutes if that. Just try and get it to be a decent length. Fuck off! It seems to be okay at turning right, it's just turning left for some reason. It's not doing it. It's not doing it as effective. Just bought a new game before. Um, here they lie. Here, here they lie. Uh, for PlayStation VR. I'm not too sure if I'm going to be doing a voice recording over that, but. From the look of it, it's meant to be a horror, so I'm probably am, I probably am going to bring my shoulder. But I'll probably try and edit it a bit. So that you can actually hear me when I'm saying it in the game, kind of thing. Because it's, it's still annoying me. Because I don't, like a horror game especially, if I'm going to start screaming, I don't want to be screaming, and then you see why I'm screaming. It wasn't a cut off that way, was it? No, what the fuck? It was my fault, I should have looked at the map. But, oh right, I didn't even see this. I should have looked at the map before I actually did this. I thought we were going to that big statue again. By the explosive barrel, but I died because I got out of my car. Okay, whatever. So find a way, find the entrance into the mansion. You better fucking. All right. Boss was a bit worse of a gap. Risk it, guys. Oh, did it? Fucking hell. Shit me up a bit, though. I wanted to show up, wasn't it? Oh. Mainly because he fucking decided to just fucking slide over to left and not jump. I didn't want him to slide. Okay. Is 
not much of a mansion. Anybody home? It's not going to be fucking easy, is it? An open window, maybe? No. Assuming it heads that way for a reason. Okay. Still not too sure if I should trust these children of the sun. Or even the faceless. We seem okay from what we're saying, but. There's got to be a big, a big bad kind of thing of this. It can't just be the dead, can it? Or is it going to be, is it not going to give you a big bad? Because it says you can go back to Haran after this, or stay here. Considering they've run out of answers in, is it going to screw you over? kind of thing and say if you want to go back to Haran you can do but as soon as you get there everyone's dead ah there we are I hope I hope that's not the case so if everyone's dead when I get there because I will be going back to Haran I don't I don't want to stay here I'll, uh, what I'll probably do is to be fair you should be able to fast travel between both places, but I don't know from what, from just going off his wording, I'd say it's either one or the other, but I don't know. I, I honestly don't know. I hope you can fast travel between them. Because I'd like to continue getting me bugger up, and my bugger leveled up, but at the same time, I don't want to stay, I don't want to stay here. Kind of thing. I much prefer the free running aspect of the game, and obviously you can't do it on this bit. There's very little free running in this. That was one of the main parts I loved about it. to kill me fine go ahead my name's kyle crane the mother's worried about you attila she sent me to check on you make sure you're okay i am most certainly not okay you can tell her that there will be no book i've hit a wall i'm just a dying old man not indiana jones dying did did you ask the mother for help she doesn't have the cure for cancer i'm afraid my days of field work are over. The problem is, and I'll quote Hamlet here, everything is fucked up. Come, sit. Have a drink with me, Mr. Crane. Listen, if it's the field work that's stopping you, just... I can go out and get whatever you need. I don't know what you're researching, but the mother really wants it finished. Hmm. You'll bring me anything I need, you say? Yeah, sure. Just make a list. It would certainly help if my electricity were restored. If I'm going to do this, I'll be looking at some very long nights. Well, I can take care of the power, but you're on your own for coffee. Uh, 
No, oh, he's got one up windows. I don't have to go all the way back down and up, do I? I hope not. Is this that red door outside? Sweet. Okay, so just gotta remember the red door leads outside. <laughs> Alright, so I'm assuming I'm just gonna follow that. Assuming there's something else. Come on. Move, move, move. Is it just because that's it? Hang on a minute. You've got red cables on you. Do we need to get you to ram it? Summer. I don't need to kill you to get the cables off you. Let's have a look at what I've got. I always go a bit further. Uh, is that all I've got? Mines, grenades. So, some grenades first.
it's not gonna work, is it? So I can't see him being as powerful as the others. It's just the fact that I don't know what his health actually is. I'm soon I've got to take him out. There we are. Yeah, I don't want an axe or something. Was that the, is that what I need? Let's have a go at this again. Oh, for God's sake. Jumps on it by running last time, so what? There we are. Why? I don't fucking understand. Fucking. No, 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 no. Drop that. Take whatever the fuck this is. So, yeah, it's just an accent. Why isn't it letting me? Missing person ID. Oh. Crane here. Just found a cadaver. Pretty sure it's one of yours. Damn. Who's in people one by one? Thanks for telling okay, us. Okay, so just randomly done a quest that I didn't even know was here. Let me do it, see ya. I'm assuming I've got to do it in an order. So the first thing I need, I need to do will be out on it. <coughs> Help if it fucking sold me. Shoot the fucker. Alright, it won't be a minute, guys. I'll fucking sort this all again off camera. Won't be a sec. Okay, guys, I figured it out after God knows how long. But you've literally got to follow the red wire and tape up some gaps. Oh, 
There was only two of them, one inside one of the buildings and then that one that I've just shown you there. Now I can do this. If it if it was a bit more specific, what it was saying, like if it said fix with like it says fix the cables, obviously, but if it said like find the rips or something or in the cables or some shifts, I don't I don't know. Be a lot easier. Just worded stuff right, it'd be fine. But it doesn't. Alright, where's this red door? Get your electricity back, Attila, and now what? Now we can get to work, Mr. Crane. I'm researching traces of the prophecy about the god of the sun in the relics of local culture. It seems like a matter of life and death to the mother, and I'm in no position to ask why. So, now we have three ancient monoliths to investigate. We're looking for specific features, so you'll need to see them in person and describe each one to me. Now that I have the power back on, we can stay in touch while you're out there. But please hurry, Mr. Crane. I won't live forever. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. I'm not too sure how long we, this has been, so I apologise if it's too short. I apologise if it's too long. We're going to finish this off next episode. Until then, good night and good luck.